You guys going? We are good. All right, guys, I'm not doing the intro. You gotta do the clap. I'm not. I'm not doing the intro. Do the clap well, first. I'm not gonna clap. do. I gotta do the clap too. Clap has All right. To be done. All right. Ryan D. No, no, that, that's not even the right <laughs> intro. What am I doing? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, guys, you know who it is, Ryan D at ZZP. And today we're going to talk about pedal commanders and why you don't want them. All right, guys, today we're going to talk about pedal commanders. And we've seen quite a few people posting about, oh, I got this pedal commander. I think it's going to do a lot for my car. Guys, honestly, not a big fan. They really don't really do much at all for your vehicle. It is much better to have an actual tune on your vehicle that works well with your vehicle that's custom tuned. Basically what it does, it makes your pedal more sensitive. Long story short, it's kind of crappy. It basically takes it, say you're at 40% throttle, it makes the car think, think that it's at 100% throttle. That's all it does. It's basically tricking your car into thinking that you're giving it more throttle than necessary versus you actually flooring your car and getting that. So pretty much you lose eh, half your pedal depending on the, the product or the pedal commander that you wanna use. Uh, you, you just lose it. All you're doing is make, making your pedal higher and so it makes the last 50% of the throttle do absolutely nothing. It's not a very good way to drive a car. You know, you, people think that it's so much faster because oh, when I halfway four, I spin and blow the tires off. No, it's literally just an effect in your mind that makes you think it's faster. It's not, you can do the same thing as flooring it. Um, this kind of goes back to when we talk about remote tuning. It, may, uh, it goes back to when we talk about getting a proper tune for your vehicle. Um, that's gonna be a much better way for you to also modulate your throttle instead of it being more on off switch like. Um, in general, um, pedal commanders or any of those kind of generic, you know, things we don't just put in your car. You want something specific for your car that's gonna make it perform like you really want it to perform. Um, so versus just tricking you into thinking you're going faster than you actually are. So another thing you can also add in there, um, there's quite a few of us that drive manual cars here. This, you know, some, some of the newer vehicles are autos as well. Um, this is very prevalent in manual cars. Um, manual cars, especially when you're trying to modulate the throttle, get traction, especially for a higher horsepower vehicle, um, kind of judge, um, you know, what kind of pedal percentage you're at. A uh, pedal commander would make that much more difficult because if you want to just, oh, I, I need to come off the throttle just a little bit, you know, just try to get traction back, your, your car is like having wide swings. So instead of going from 40% throttle to like 30%, you're going from 100 to like 40 to like 20 or whatever, however they have it set up. So it's really not good. Same thing for road coursing, actually. Um, myself, Tyler, uh, Tim, we all, we all road course our vehicles. And trying to even, even considering modulating the throttle when the car isn't actually at 100% when you're flooring it or anywhere in between, it's, make, it's basically some made up number that, you, that uh, will not be accurate to where your foot's at. It's a really not a very intuitive way to drive your car. Uh, if you wanna be a full throttle, pin it to the ground, floor it all the way, which we see in a lot of our scans. A lot of you guys don't actually floor floor your cars. Um, but, you know, when you're, when you're trying to modulate the throttle and know exactly what you can and let off and let back into it, um, it's better to have an accurate pedal feel rather than have one that's just turned up to some arbitrary percentage earlier in the pedal. Uh, you really wanna ha have it be accurate to where your foot's at. Um, so, in general, our opinion, don't run a pedal commander. They're silly, they really don't do anything besides make you think you're going faster than you actually are. And who wants to do that? And also, when you go to a car meet and tell people what your mileists are, they're probably talking shit behind your back if you say you have a pedal commander. I'm just saying. So, all right guys, as per usual, if you have any questions about this, please feel free to email customer service at zzperformance.com. And as usual, Ryan D at ZZP, signing off.